first ever blind celebrity danced in the ballroom. It's fair to say that Chris and Diane brought the scouse down with their Beatles based cha cha cha. That was for you, Dave. Your neck was lurching forward. You were picking up your feet way too much. Actually, I'm quite shocked and very emotional. Fabulous. Well, it's one of the most extraordinary things I've ever seen in my entire life. Just brilliant. It's Chris and Diane. Oh. Chris, the viewers didn't know what to expect, but I don't think neither did you no. know what to expect. Uh, can you sum up the emotions of Saturday night? I was terrified, Jeanette. <laughs> I was uh, honestly, what wasn't I? How, how terrified you were, was I? Uh, one to a hundred, ninety-nine point nine. Yes, <laughs> you were pretty terrified. I didn't know what I was getting into. There were so many bits in that dance that if they went wrong, it was just the end of the dance. But do you know what? You couldn't tell. Oh. It just looked like you were having the time of your life. Oh, out do there. you know what? As well, like when we're when we're training, I can hear Diane around me. I can hear her footsteps. I can hear her existing around me. Existing. And I knew I knew from the um, the opening show when we did that group dance that when the crowd are uh, cheering and that. It, it closes in the room and I lose all of that sound. Ooh. So not only can I not see her, but I can't hear her around yeah. me. Um, and so I, I was worried that we wouldn't be able to pull off all these things we've been practicing mm. yeah. in that kind of cauldron of noise on live TV. And there's no chance of a good edit, is there? You no, know, no, no, it's, it's live, Chris, yeah, it's so live. when we got through it, oh, the relief. Oh, Hurrah! Oh, so and you didn't just get through it. You absolutely nailed it. And Diane, so many viewers are excited for you. Congratulations. I mean, Thank how you. special was that dance and how special is this partnership? I said to Chris, it was probably one of my most favorite dance moments ever. Honestly, hand on heart, nothing can compare to that. I want to take all that, bottle it up and keep it forever because it was so special. It, if nothing can compare to it, why is it only one of your most memorable moments? Why isn't it? <laughs> Why isn't it your most memorable moment? All right, Chris, I'll change it to my Listen, most the, memorable moment. Yeah. The oh, banter bad. between the two of you, though, is honestly <laughs> hilarious. You have these amazing daily video diaries that you've been posting. They're one of my favorite things to see on social media. Listen to this. Chris, we're live. Well, we're not, we're recording. We're recording. Yeah, the opposite of live. With the opposite of live. You had two choices and you got it wrong. <laughs> Basically, Chris has not been blessed by seeing my dad's messages yet. Or I've... anything in life. <laughs> but let's not just stop at not seeing your dad's messages. I haven't even seen our dance. <laughs> oh my gosh, incredible. You two are really funny. But Diane, <laughs> you have commended Chris on his work ethic. He's yes. working really, really hard in the rehearsal rooms. How have you adapted, though, your training from your previous partners to now working with Chris? I mean, yeah, it's obviously very different. Um, we use a lot of feel, don't we? Mm -hmm. So I'll, I'll be like, right, get down on your knees and feel my legs. And so it's it's a different way of teaching. He yeah. he hears the sounds as well, very, very well. So you'll say to me, right, can you just do that with your feet so he can hear what I'm doing? And then he kind of makes something of that. But it's it's interesting and we're still learning and we're still working it out together. But muddling it is, our way through it. We're muddling we? our way yeah. through it. But it's working. Like, what we're doing, and the obvious, I can't just show Chris what I want yeah, him course, to do. So it's a lot of explanations, which we found I'm not the best at them, am I? Absol no, I mean, There's a few words I don't know how to say. a lot say. of words she doesn't know what, what they mean either. But yeah, we, we're finding the, the touch and feel and the sounds working well, really well. Speaking of sound, you have quite, you know, a, pros do it in general when they're dancing on that floor with their celebrity partners. They give them the numbers and little cues through noise. Yes. But with the two of you, it's extra important. Aww. Have a listen to what the viewers didn't hear on Saturday night. <laughs> make you feel like you're wasting your time, but I had none of that from you in the room. <laughs> right? So, if you were doing that for my benefit, you were wasting your time. I need a microphone, don't I, Chris? Yeah, oh, yeah well... We yeah. need a little inner ear. Well, listen, we've actually had something come in through WhatsApp. We're very oh. cool, and it takes two now for the two of you. And this has come in from Grace in Newcastle. And she said, what's... She's got a question, actually. What's the best quality you have found in each other since being partnered together? What's the best quality about Diane, Chris? Oh, go on, Chris. We don't have all day, though, so yeah. just one of them, oh, please. Just one of them. Um, <laughs> she's really funny. 
Oh. She's really funny. She's easy to, uh, to have a laugh with. Um, as you know, as you've played the, one of the clips from the videos there that we've been doing and that. And um, and and that's that's that that's, that works for me, oh, you know, that we can have a laugh and I and you know work hard, get it done. Yeah. But um, but it's fun along the way. And I quickly. And I would say that you are just up to try anything, and I think I commend you for that. That's incredible. Oh, yeah. God. He's up for it. He's up uh, for right, it. Right, we're moving on to this week because you're dancing now a foxtrot, slightly yeah. different to this. Yes, the tans be and beyond, be, be foolish, be happy. Be Chris, yeah. you entertain us. You've showed us you can dance. Yeah. Technique. This is going to start coming into play now. Yeah. Uh, how is the technique with the fox truck? I've never heard the word frame so much in my life. <laughs> <laughs> she just shouts at me, frame, frame, elbows, uh -huh. shoulders. It's it, it's it's so like. It's less mayhem than the, than the last dance. It's a yeah. little bit gentler, it's more elegant. That's what we're aiming for. But this, um, it's like the, the top half of your body needs to be rigid and the bottom half needs to be a bit floppier, doesn't it? And right. it's, um, I love that word. You've got floppier. it right, though. That's exactly it, isn't <laughs> yeah. it? Yeah. yeah. But my arms, my arms get told off all the time. Yeah. I accept no <laughs> responsibility for books. them. It's just my arms. <laughs> Yeah, but Di, when it comes to the leading aspect yes. uh, of this particular dance, mm -hmm. how is Chris finding the leading? He's finding it really, really good, actually. I think what we've tried to do is really focus on the technique of the drive and the foot action yes. and the movement. And then naturally, what is happening is he is leading me. So we've worked from the ground up. And uh, and that's really helped. And I genuinely feel like he's leading me. Amazing. So you've done angles, uh, incredible. isn't it? It's the angles. It's all about the angles. Angles. Well, you can't turn until you see a point. You've got to turn what you feel is the angle. Oh. And that's kind of just got to be. I reckon you're going to be a really good leader for that specific reason. Exactly. He has to feel your he's got body. To feel the body. Yeah. Exactly. Well, listen. Best of luck to the two of you on Thank Saturday. You. I can't wait to watch you again. You're brilliant. We won. Let's hear it for Chris hey. and Diane.